Is this belief costing you sales? If you're a coach, consultant, therapist or trainer and you don't currently have all of the clients you want, then I want you to pay close attention to this video because in the next couple of minutes I'm going to share with you one of the most common limiting beliefs I come across and how it is killing sales. I'm Bernadette Doyle and over the last 16 years I've been helping people like you to get more clients online and that means that you finally master client attraction and never have to stress about where your next client is coming from. And during this time I've come across um, a, a common limiting belief and it goes like this. If you're good at what you do then you shouldn't need to market or sell yourself because people will find you through word of mouth and re recommendation. Now, I understand why people think this, and on the face of it, it's, it's common sense. But you need to understand, if you believe this, exactly how it's impacting your sales. Because what I observe in the people who think this is that they spend all of their time and energy getting better at the thing that they do. So if they're a consultant, they're improving their consulting thing, their skills. If they're a therapist, they're continuing to take courses, collect certificates, get better at what they do but always at the expense of marketing and selling. And here is what I've discovered. The people that have this, when we dig deeper and explore further, there is always a hidden fear. And the fear is about being more visible, about putting themselves out there. Sometimes it's a fear that they're gonna be judged or humiliated. Sometimes it's a fear that they won't be able to cope with all the demand if they are more visible. Sometimes it's a fear that they won't be able to deliver. They might get more clients, but they then can't actually deliver to those clients' expectations, and then they're gonna have unhappy clients. Now, if you can relate to any of these, I want to talk to you about you know, what the hidden cost is here. Because the fact is, if you are reluctant to market yourself in any way, what's happening is there are people out there who do want and need your help right now, but they have no idea that you exist. You are the best kept secret in town. And worse than that, those people, because they are looking for help, will probably end up doing business with people who don't have your talent or don't have your integrity. So today, if you can relate to this, I've got a question for you. Are you willing to put your fears of being more visible, are you willing to make them less important than getting out there and serving the people who, who are looking for you and need your help? Now, I know that that might sound scary, but I'm asking you today to just take one step. What is one thing that you could do today which would be one step in making yourself more visible and valuable to the people out there who need your help? And know that there is someone out there who a week from now, a month from now, three months from now, a year from now is going to be so grateful to you that you took that step because it enabled them to find you, the person who is the answer to their prayers. So... If this has inspired you to take that one step, I would love it if you would share it in the comments below. Know that I'm here rooting for you. There are people out there that need your help, so let's get this done.